like the 1989 hilarious film, See No Evil, Hear No Evil, in which Gene Wilder is a deaf man with a blind friend, Richard Pryor. Come on! Congressman Tom Rice refuses to see or hear the facts surrounding the impeachment of President Trump. The House Intelligence Committee concluded that President Trump is guilty of abuse of power using his office for personal advantage or gain by withholding desperately needed financial aid from Ukraine unless they agreed to dig up dirt on former Vice President Joe Biden. But Congressman Rice blindly defended Trump. Said Rice in his taxpayer-funded e-newsletter to constituents, the Democrats' impeachment inquiry continued this week. With each witness and hearing, the fundamental facts remain the same. There was no quid pro quo, bribery, pressure, or impeachable offense. Either Rice wore earplugs during those hearings, or he could Mr. care less Giuliani's about the facts. Were a quid pro quo witness after witness, including the ambassador to the European Union, Zelensky. who contributed a million bucks to Trump's inauguration, testified under oath that Trump tried to cut that deal the with the Ukrainian president DNC for the investigation and he for sought. Mr. Giuliani was expressing the desires of the President of the United States, and we knew these investigations were important to the President. It was the infamous quid pro quo. Now, Mr. Rice, if it's okay for President Trump to bribe the head of a foreign government and then try to hinder the investigation, what's to stop future presidents from doing the same thing? Take off your blinders, Congressman. Take out your earplugs. And when the House finally votes, do what's right to protect our Constitution and our country. It's time to take a stand. Music